For more thoughts on the Miami Hurricanes football team and schedule and, and all that good stuff, check out InsideTheU.com at 24-7 Sports. Which team on the 2020 schedule maybe concerns us the most for the Miami Hurricanes? Now, as you can see, I am not the only one asking these questions. 247 Sports is asking you guys the same questions that I've been asking. Now, they gave their insight on who, who they think will challenge, might be a challenge for Miami on the 2020 schedule. Now, we're going to dig into this. We're not going to go into the whole entire video. We're just going to dissect it for what it is. And we're going to break this down a little bit. So let's see what they got to say. Um, so the team that I'm kind of circling at the moment right now is, uh, is definitely the North Carolina game. One obviously being Stan Howell. They're going to be coming off of a bye. Okay, so North Carolina. If you've been watching any of my videos recently, you've been watching any of my live, North Carolina is one of the main teams I talk about being a threat on Miami's 2020 schedule. As we know, the schedule is not that difficult, but there are teams on there that could pose a threat, and Miami should not take any team on the schedule lightly, but North Carolina is one of those teams that they should play with, push, with a lot of caution. Now, Miami will be playing North Carolina coming off of a bye week. If you know Miami's woes of 2019, then you know that coming off of bye weeks is not the greatest thing for Miami. The preparation that went into coming off a of bye week is very questionable. Now, hopefully these issues have been addressed and hopefully taken care of, but that is one concern, bye week. To be different, I'll go with Virginia Tech. But Virginia Tech returns their quarterback in, in Hendon Hooker, who now, as we all know, Bud Foster of Virginia Tech, their defensive coordinator, has retired. So they're going to be coming into this season with a new defensive coordinator. So that should be interesting to see itself. But Miami is coming off of a game versus Florida State. As you already know, that game will be intense. That game could be put on the list of one of the games that Miami could potentially lose going into um, 2020, you know, because... Virginia, like I said, in all of my other videos, I see Florida State and North Carolina being one of the threats on our schedule. But according to these guys, we should also be looking out at Virginia Tech. Virginia Tech did beat Miami last season. We all saw that. But it should be interesting to see in the season if Virginia Tech improves. You know, they do bring back their quarterback, like he said. So... We can only speculate right now and make predictions and everything, but apparently now it's not just Florida State and North Carolina that we should, you know, pay attention to, but also Virginia Tech, which, you know, there are, Virginia Tech has always been in that question of teams that Miami could possibly worry about, but who knows? We'll see. Right now, I, th I still think the schedule with Miami – is looking 12 and 0 if played correctly, if mistakes aren't made, if you know executions are done correctly. So we can only speculate right now and make predictions going into the season, but it should be interesting. North Carolina, Virginia Tech, I think those are two definite teams to keep an eye on with the schedule.